everyone. Today I'm going to show you a quick, easy, and inexpensive craft. I'm going to make a pedestal plate. Um, you just need a few supplies. You need a plate of your choice. Now this one I got at um, Home Goods. It was $3.99. But I've seen cute plates at Dollar Tree or you might just have one in the house that you'd want to use. Then I got um, a craft paint. I got that at Hobby Lobby. I think it was about a dollar thirty or forty. And then the um, candlestick holder I got at Dollar Tree. And then a couple of things I just had already were the paintbrush. And you're going to want uh, E6000 or a similar type um, super glue. I'm not sure how much that cost me. I've had it a long time, but it's really good stuff. And uh, I know you can get it at any hardware store or Walmart or Target or anywhere like that. You're also going to want some uh, old newspaper to work the project on. Okay, so let's get started. Okay, so my candlestick, I painted it and I let it dry uh, about a good hour. I did have to give it another coat. I just, it was just a little too transparent for me. Um, so I did another coat, waited an, about another hour, and now it is ready to be glued to the plate. As I mentioned earlier, I have the E6000. Now just a tip, if your glue, um, right now it's pouring out, I don't know why. Um, if, you know, sometimes when the glue sits, it doesn't um, want to squeeze out, it sticks. Just get a toothpick and just stick it on in there and, um, you know, like just push on it a couple times and that'll open that up and it will come out again for you. Um, be careful, you don't want to get E6000 or any kind of super glue on your hands because it's going to, um, it'll dry out your hands, something terrible, and then um, you could possibly get your fingers stuck or something to your something stuck to your fingers just bad news all the way around so what you want to do is just take a thin uh, squeeze of the glue right around the rim of the candlestick you don't want to miss a spot but you don't want it um, real goopy or gloppy on the top either you just want it um, you know, thoroughly, you want it completely covered, but not gloppy, I guess is the technical word, gloppy. No gloppiness. Okay, so once you have it, eh, I'm missing a couple spots here. Once you have it all the way around, you want to flip your plate upside down. I hope you guys can see this. Take your candlestick and put it smack dab in the middle of the bottom of your plate. And then what I like to do is just kind of push on it for maybe 30 seconds or so. 20, 30 seconds. Just give it some good adhesion time to make sure you've got it on there. And then just let it sit. Um... I would just read the directions on the type of glue you have, but I might just let this sit overnight um, and then flip it over and, and use it. I'm not sure. I haven't quite decided yet, but um, I will be back again to show you the final um, look. And uh, yeah. Oh, one thing I do want to tell you before you put the... Before you glue the candlestick, oops, that is not sticking yet, is it? Um, before you put the candlestick on your plate, 
you want to make sure that your plate is clean and dry. A lot of times they put the a price sticker on the bottom of the plate, so you don't want to be sticking your candlestick to that. So wash it, take any sticker off if there is any on the bottom, wash it, dry it, and then attach your candlestick to the bottom. Okay, so I'll be back uh, to show you the final look. Okay, so here is the finished plate. And you see the candlestick. I think it turned out really cute. And I don't have any goodies to put on it yet. I'm going to be baking next week and next weekend so I can put some goodies on it then. But it looks so cute even just um, sitting there with nothing on it because the plate is so decorative and it was super easy. So, and you can't get any cheaper than what I think it cost me $5 to make this at the most. And I still have extra paint to use for other pro projects. So the paint that I bought specifically for the, for the candlestick, uh, I still have plenty of, you know, like I said, for other things. So that was a minimal cost. The plate was $3.99 at Home Goods, and the candlestick was just a dollar at the Dollar Tree. So I hope you enjoyed this video, and um, if you make one yourself, please, uh, you know, send me a picture. Um, I have my Facebook links, Instagram, Pinterest, um, or give me, a, you know, let me know in the comments. And have a great day. Bye-bye.